For me, the main thing is seeing a change in people over time and that perception that you've added value to somebody and they're going to go off and do something that they wouldn't necessarily have done uh, if you hadn't taught them. I've always wanted to be an academic, even when I was five years old. I enjoy sharing my experiences, my research, my knowledge with the students and listening to them, understanding their perspective. When you understand the way that students think, then you can develop ways of teaching and helping them learn that, that are suited to their mindset. I try and ground theoretical concepts in real world markets that are relevant to the students. Two examples would be we study the Microsoft case and we study the beer industry. One of the other key things in teaching is just to try and always make it as applied to the real world as possible. I've spent more than 20 years designing and delivering training workshops for managers and for entrepreneurs and I really enjoy drawing on those experiences within my teaching. Being a bridge to that knowledge is where we can really add value to students. So as much as possible, I'm always trying to incorporate the latest knowledge. It's very valuable um, beyond just teaching books that students can read for themselves. To take the risk to try something new and a different idea, knowing by definition it's innovation so it might fail, I think that's probably what makes somebody a really inspiring lecturer or teacher. I've created a module where law students are paired with engineering students so that the law students advise the engineering students about their intellectual property rights and that is so beneficial. Trying things different, seeing them work with students is so exciting because learning isn't just academic. It is about developing a sense of ethics and how things fit together in the wider scheme of things. My aim is always to try and inform better citizens for the future. The world is changing dramatically, um, but change brings opportunities. And if you've got the right attitude, you can really take advantage of all the opportunities out there. And I believe that it's my job to ensure that my students have the right attitude to go out into the big wide world and make the most of those fantastic opportunities out there.